Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Express VTU for all. So today we are going to solve a very important question from module 1 Introduction to Finite Automata. So our question is construct a DFA which accepts strings of zeros and ones where the value of each string is represented by a binary number. Only the string representing 0 mod 5 should be accepted. So in this question we have to accept the strings which we will divide by 5. So the remainder will be 0. Like our language accepted by the string is firstly the 0 will be accepted by this. Then the 5. Uh, how we write the 5 in binary terms? We write it by 0, 1, 0, 1. Like this. And then 10 is divisible by 5. So 1, 0, 1, 0. Like this so on the string will be accepted by our this DFA. So now our first step is step 1 is to identify the radix input symbols and the divisor k. What is radix here? Radix value is 2 because it is binary number. For binary number radix value is 2. For decimal value it is 10. And now the input symbols are 0 and 1. And the value of k. k is nothing but the this value by which we will divide the numbers and the value of d is equals to 0 comma 1 d is nothing but the digits now our step 2 is compute the possible remainders their remainders represent the states of dfa means we have to write the remainders by which we divide the value with 5 so the remainder will be 0 1 2, 3 and 4. If we divide any number with 5, this will be the remainders. So our next step is step 3. In this step, we are using two formulas. First formula is transition of q of i comma d equal to q of j. And the second formula is q of j is equal to r into i plus d mod K. With the help of these two formulas, we are going to make a table. So, our first thing will be remainder. Then the D section. Then our this formula R into I plus D into mod K. And then the this formula q of i comma d equal to q of j. So the first remainder value is 0, this one. And d value is we will take first 0. Then j is equal to r. What's the value of r? 2. i value is 0 here. So we will put here in this formula. And d value we take 0. And mod 5. So what the what will come here it will come 0 only 2 into 0 0 0 plus 0 0 mod 5 is 0 so here q of i q of i is i value is 0 q naught d value is 0 0 and q of j q and j value is, here is 0 like this we have to do all the remainder part now j is equals to r 2 into i value is 0 plus d value is 1 here and mod 5 so here it comes 1 and the transition for this q, q naught comma 1 will goes to what's the value of j here q1 like this we have to do for the rest of the cases for the remainder z1 so by putting all the uh, values in this formulas we are getting this table so with the help of this table we are going to draw a dfa diagram so how we will do this dfa diagram so from the table we can clearly see that q naught with the uh, remainder 0 and d value 0 this will be our initial state so initial state is our q naught now how we will make the DFA diagram with this table? We will see here with the transition formula. 
with the input uh, with the state q naught with the input symbol zero, it will be self loop to the q naught like this q naught with the input symbol zero with the self loop q naught. Now q naught with the input symbol one it is going to q one. Q naught with the input symbol one it is going to q one. Like that q one with the input symbol zero it is going to q two. Zero it is going to q two. And then uh, Q1 with the input symbol 1 going to Q3. Like that Q2 input symbol 0 going to Q4. Q2 with input symbol 1 going to Q0. Symbol 1 going to Q0. And then Q3 input symbol 0 going to Q1. And Q3 input symbol 1 going to Q2. And the last Q4 with the input symbol 0 going to Q3. And Q4 with the input symbol 1 going to Q4. Which is a self loop. Like this, we will draw the DFA diagram with the help of this table. So now we have to do the final state. Initial state is Q0 and the final state we have to declare. So from the language L equal to 0, 5, 10. This is binary numbers. 5 and 10. So what will be our final state? Our final state will be Q0 itself. This will be initial and final state. Because we have to accept the 0, 5 and 10 like 0 will be accepted here then 0 1 then 0 then 1 it will accept this also like this this will be our final state thank you for watching our video